dog a treat. <laughs> and he carries it around with him and, and cries. Because <laughs> he can't find a place to bury it. He wants to bury it so bad. It's Don't a mess. fucking biscuit. Eat your Eat fucking it. milk bone. Eat the milk bone. <laughs> you fool. Kid. staring at me now. Like, father. Both of our cats were inside of the tiny bed that shaped like a cat together. And it oh was so God. cute. And I cry every day. <laughs> I cry every day at how cute our cats are. Except for this morning when I got up to pee early. And so I didn't have my glasses on. Laser fucking climbed up the fucking shower curtain to like the top. And I'm like, I don't know what to do about this right now. He was up so high. And I'm like, I guess you're just up there now. Because I can't fucking grab you down. I mean, cats are allowed to be that high because they can fall. Well... I'm like you're a maniac, and I can't, I can't stop you. He won't eat it. <laughs> He's just pouting. <laughs> He's just crying. looking at it. Let me bury eat your goddamn biscuit. Eat biscuits, you fool! Oh. Eat biscuits. <laughs> I wish I had a biscuit right now from Cracker Barrel. <laughs> Waterloo. Waterloo. Can you hear my switch? I'll see everyone, if, uh, everyone said they were bored of you because you won't eat your biscuit. Yeah, Kit. Okay. Sorry, Tim. I don't know where your switch is. What are you talking about me? I'll eat the biscuit. Everyone's bored of you because you won't eat your biscuit, Tim. I'll eat a fucking biscuit. Oofed. Chat room, that's a really good oh. fucking idea, but you said it and now I can't do it. What? What? Chat room has a really good idea. Oh, the reverse Lonnie being... But now I can't Kit. do it. Michael, please watch the flash. <laughs> oh, is there a reverse flash? We're yeah, we're watching. Uh, that's what I've been watching all day. I watched GBBO for like yes. two episodes while I watched Christmas presents. And then we've been watching the flash all day. And it makes me so happy. And Michael, I just want you, I just want you to watch the flash. You Maybe saw it, you guys. If you if you said it to me, then I could have done it. Damn. I'm taking credit. We take everything back. We take it back. We never talked about the reverse flash. You don't even know what it entails. <laughs> yeah, what's that? The du- is it like slow? DC shit is super so slow. slow. No, stupid. He, he's very fast, but okay. So Flash has is it still his brother. No, it's not his brother. It, it's really weird. It's his um, stepsister's fiance's relative in the future. Who comes right. back in time to okay. make sure that Barry gets powers? And Barry is like Barry. red. Barry's, Barry's the Flash. The flash. And Even I knew that. Barry has um, Barry like red with yellow Flash, yellow wow. lightning whenever he runs, and Reverse Flash is yellow with red when he runs, and he's very <laughs> evil. <laughs> oh is, no! Is his name himself? No, I can't tell you his name because it's a spoiler. If you haven't watched the show, you got to watch the show and then you find out who it is. And it's a wow. I messaged Bachman and I said, I hate this character because he bad. <laughs> and then Bachman's like, shut up, just watch. Um, Nika, quick question. Have you watched Killing Eve yet? Bad. Oh, uh, exactly 100% your shit. Please, You're going to lose your mind, Nika. It's so it fucking on. good. It's on Hulu. It just got put on Hulu. It is about... It's on BBC America. Well, but yeah, but it's on Hulu now. But yes, it's on BBC America. Um, It is about... Sandra O oh is the main character. She's like an investigator, and she's investigating a female assassin. <laughs> I heard about and... this show! Oh! It's so good! <laughs> okay, I will I will add it to my list. It's It's really, really good. I am like in mourning because just as I'm finding out, well, just as I'm watching Killing Eve, Tumblr, uh, not suitable for work, is no longer a thing. And I'm like, no, but I need to go find it. So I was thinking about it. I was like, oh my God. Like, at first I thought it was Reddit. And I was like, what the fuck am I going to do? There's a little like NSFW on Reddit. Like, why even use it? But then I thought, no, wait, that's not the same thing. But then I realized of all the good, like, anime and overwatch porn that's on tumblr and i thought where will it live now i mean everyone's like dumping it on twitter and stuff now it's i i have just started following like tons of artists that i followed on tumblr that are like well i'm on twitter now and i'm like awesome follow you thanks damn i need to do that but it's very sad end of an era i started watching this show called jojo 
<gasps> Wait, when did you start watching JoJo, Michael? Like two days ago. Okay. <laughs> oh, we've already, no, we've already screamed at Michael. I won't scream at him more though. No, because we'll get mad, and we'll then we'll scream How at you... Carly and cuss at her again. No, How because you watch JoJo. Really JoJo is okay. Crunchy here's the thing. On a team. Team. I don't have Crunchyroll. It, it's on uh, Hulu too. Oh, okay, Hulu? fine. I can watch it on yeah. Hulu. Yeah, or at least it used to be. Um, the beginning. I can. I would say you can definitely skip like a lot of Stardust Crusaders because it's like whatever. watch the first two ep- seasons because they're they're the first good two and seasons fine. are like you just know that the first season quote unquote is like eight episodes or something. It's yeah. like a little short. Do you guys have Funimation? I did forever and then I like never never used it so I got rid of it. Oh, okay. We had it and we switched to Crunchyroll and then yeah, I feel like Crunchyroll has more stuff that I. The actually only watched. thing I watched was Berserk with the bad animation. Oh and no! I couldn't get, I couldn't get myself oh. to start. I. I finished the like one season oh, that's on there. It's and rough, it was man. Season, and I, yeah, I was like, I can't do it. All the new stuff. Sorry. Yeah, the new yeah. Berserk. Yeah, uh, that bad. is totally fine. It's real bad. Not I, like old original Berserk. I yeah, watched Hawkman the first and are getting smashed. Three episodes, and but then I was thinking about maybe watching the movie. I have uh, never seen the JoJo movie. Wait, are you talking about Berserk or JoJo? Sorry, JoJo. I've I'm never sorry. seen the JoJo. The OVA is like old. I know that. Apparently, like it's it's I think it's animated by like Satoshi Khan or something like crazy, and it's apparently like very worth watching on its own for sure. But Stardust Crusaders is just like a million episodes long. Yeah, it it has Grandpa Jojo Rituals, uh, Joe Taro sucks, uh, Kakyoin sucks. He's fine. Polnareff is fine. He's stupid, and I like him. <laughs> but I like um uh I, I like uh, uh Abdul though he's good yeah but uh, Joe Toro is great in the next season he's really good in the next season so you should just skip to Diamond is Unbreakable yeah because <laughs> it's good it sucks because yeah. Grandpa Jojo is one of the best yeah M- Mr. Law tomorrow night 7 p.m. Central Time we're gonna be doing some Smash streaming until the wee hours of the morning so have some coffee stay up stay up real late. Say La V, are you saying that Joe Toro doesn't suck? He is great in Diamonds and Unbreakable because he loves starfish. He loves dolphins. And dolphins. He's a marine biologist. He's just boring. For some reason. Kakuyoin is boring. They're no. both the type. <laughs> oh, a little, 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 little is very good, though. Yeah. Um, Grandpa Jojo rules kicks ass. The, the, the pig coming to the toilet is very good. The, see, you never got to the episode. I should make you watch the Mariah episodes because she uses baggage to make it look like Abdul and Grandpa Jojo are fucking each other. I, I actually funny. have seen that because you, you watched me. Yeah. In front of me. I was like losing my entire mind over it. There are, part, there are parts of Stardust Crusaders that are good. It's just really fucking long. so long. Um, and they're, they're creepy towards a 13-year-old. That's drawn like a 13-year-old, yeah, not a 19-year-old. That like, like most pretty anime. quick, though. Um, um, Luckily, mm. part five fucking rules and is insane. Ba-da-da. Do you guys want to start recording? Wait, Tim, weren't you I eating some Annie's? Did. Yeah, he was. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. eating some Annie's now, Mo dude. Nah, no, 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 motherfuckers, no. I had an Annie's burrito tonight. I'm not even. No, no, Amy. Annie's is I had Amy's. Shit. Amy's burrito. That's different. Oh, uh, Amy's not the same vein. Get out of here, bro. It's the same love, vein for sure. Amy's oh. has a wonderful tortilla and black bean bowl, which is like basically tortilla chips with salsa, cheese, and tofu on them, and black beans with cheese. I on think top. I have that in my it's, freezer right now. It's it's so bro. fucking good. <laughs> this episode bro. brought to you by Annie's. <laughs> <laughs> Wowie. Da-da-da. Shiny boys. <laughs> Remember um, JoJo Part Five, like the ending song, literally uses the word "horny" in it so because horny. JoJo's the horniest show on the planet. Michael, what? All we heard you say was Michael, and then your audio cut out. Yeah, you're still muted. Oh, you shit. yelled so loud now that you now broke you're the muted. internet. Still muted. He's not muted. Yes, he is. Bachman, do not do this. <laughs> do what? I, oh, I thought, thought you were talking about Michael. No, 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 no. I was like, Michael's not muted. I can hear him. Michael, Michael is not muted. I don't have a big pencil. I'm just really small. He's, He's just, just a little boy. I'm just Michael's a, a baby. I can see the muted icon next to you guys. Yeah, in in the uh, appear thing, you guys are muted. Yeah. Oh, hello? 
There, you're much better. Oh, yeah. Okay. I didn't realize it. I thought you guys were fucking with us. Our connection no, no, to the no. microphone is getting worse, so I punched the table. Um, and then so it me. I got so excited about JoJo that I crocheted bad. Da -da -da. All right, let's start. Even yeah, though I want to scream at me. Have audacity open. Why yeah. are you screaming? Are you screaming at me in a positive way? About, no, he way. wanted to scream at you about Evangelion. But the problem is, I'm not screaming at you. I'm screaming at Carly, and we already screamed at Carly, so it's it's, so it's already done. Now. <laughs> you should watch it by yourself. The, the lie to your wife. I'm watching it at the gym. Um, on <laughs> go. <laughs> oh wait, <laughs> Eva. You're not Eva, right? No, no you, I'm okay. done. I finished Eva, except for the last. Watch the last two episodes. I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Oh. Uh, on go. Three, two, one, go. We're recording. We're recording. We're recording. We're recording. We're recording. <laughs> did you, uh, did you all hear that uh, new season of Letterkenny starts at, starts this Christmas? I, I yeah, did, I watched buddy. the Trizailer. Oh, yeah. Uh, we still have to watch the third season. We do. We gotta finish watching it now. The third? Or is it really like the fifth? The third. We, we're behind. We're like real behind. We're way behind. Um, yeah. My Plex server is down because I don't have that computer anymore. So. Oh, okay. We're we gonna watch the other we day. were trying to watch and we're like, something's wrong. Because it's cold now, so we don't need our air so we can finally hear it. But maybe we should just reason. try to steal it somewhere. We probably just our own damn self, so we yeah, don't have to go guys, through. You guys got to have something oh. weird going on because I've I've tried it on a bunch of different setups. Like it's through yeah. the Plex server, it's never been quiet. It's so quiet. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. Maybe sure. Is it because we have a 4K TV? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it, it doesn't affect the sound. The sound the, you're still the, listening the to 1080p sound. sound. <laughs> that's true. That's just fa that's science. No, I'm sure it's in my rent, but. <clears throat> I don't feel like something we can fix. Yes. I mean, so why would you want to? I like being quiet. Nico, are you caught up on uh, Flash yet? Let's start a new conversation. No. I... no! <laughs> we haven't watched the episode. I think there's like one episode that we're behind. But I'm loving Nora. I want to date her. <laughs> Who doesn't? But crossover starts on Sunday. So yeah. Catch oh, up. no. Bitch, I'm ready. I'm so ready. 8 p.m. Central. Or You're not. You're an episode behind. We're gonna make it happen. Okay, let's I go. Watch <laughs> I can't watch it whenever it airs anyway, so I gotta watch it after. Gotta watch on that CW app. Ba, ba, ba. Greetings, adventurers. You have joined us for another episode of the Drunks and Dragons podcast. I am your dungeon master, Michael DeMauro, and with me is Jennifer Cheek. Hey, everyone. Tim Lanning. Hey, everybody. It's great to be here. Thank you ever so much for having me. Mike Bachman. I thought about saying something serious, but you know I can't do that. <laughs> Penny Howard. I thought about saying something funny, but all I have is this Roth IRA. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? I, that's this a callback. funny. A Roth IRA is very serious. It's very uh, serious. Uh, I get it. There's Usually... The uh, intros are uh, uh, inside joke between no one, and now it Nika decided to go uh, no, in a making, chaotic uh, direction. She's making <laughs> Roth IRA jokes. It was, yeah, man. Um, no do you like how I did the same it. order again? I, I that, noticed that. that. That's not prepared at all. That's two weeks in a row. I know. I'm really fucking things up. It really got me off guard. Um, can I'm I, busy crocheting. Can I say something real quick? Yeah, Tim. Yeah, yeah. Tim. Can I... Uh, uh, real quick to say to all the artists out there, your art is great. You're the real MVP. You're the real MVP. You know, don't don't overly harshly judge yourself. Your art is great. And don't hide your light under a bushel or your art. So unless true. it's on Tumblr because I don't want you to get in trouble. Yeah. Um, so, but, oh, so actually I'll, I'll address it really quickly. Someone tweeted at me and asked if I was cool with smut uh, writing or art being done in my character. I could not be more cool with it. Please go hog wild. Yeah. So happy. The yeah. only thing that I personally might request is please, please do not ever send me smut of me, Nika, doing yes, something to another person. But my characters go hog wild, friends. Yeah. <laughs> um, Agreed. Yeah, you can use me to do uh sex but there is difference between a gal on the internet versus a boy so yeah i think you need to run the concept by me first we'll workshop an idea make sure that it's tasteful um <laughs> but yeah no i mean 
I want someone to do the Jayla artwork uh, with the milk, but instead of it being Jayla, it's me. <laughs> Just you two planning? <laughs> oh my. If yeah, anybody... I don't want to see that. I don't know. I don't want to see my friend being milked. Why not? <laughs> I hear you. If anybody wants to do artwork of me, except my dad's proud of me, that would be fine. <laughs> Bachman, I'm proud of you. I'll be your dad. Well, <laughs> let's not put too much on our, our beautiful artist. Let's start. Oh slow. yeah, I'm just saying. Let's, let's put these lights back under these bushels. Yeah, put them back under for just a little bit. Uh, just kidding. Um, but I, you know, I, I always see on Twitter folks talking about listening to the uh, other podcasts, our podcast, while doing art. I think you're doing great. I also want to give a shout out to folks um, driving trucks, to folks uh, working in hellish office parks. I just yep. want to say y'all are kicking ass, and even if it's not uh, for the very specific people, this is not what you wanted to be when you were eight years old. I'm very proud of you for getting shit done. Yeah, man, and we support you. Oh, yeah. shit. Hey, Sandra does art. Sandra does art. Abort. I did not say smut where my dad's proud of me. I said no! art where my dad's proud of me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pump <Big> the brakes. <laughs> um, hey, buddy. How was your commute today? Did you have a good breakfast? I'm happy for you. Was your boss a dick? Well, they're an asshole, and I hate them. Yeah, be yeah. better. We'll yell about them on the way home. Yeah, you know, we're here to vent for you. Don't tell us, but, you know. <laughs> Actually, you know, let Maybe us know. I don't know, shit. Shit, fuck. Shit's bad. Shit's bad, bro. Absolutely. <laughs> um, happy holidays. Can we see what our oh, energy yeah. is? My huh? energy is weird and good right now. Yeah. I mean, it's over 9,000. I have uh, Tetris energy, which is because I'm doing crochet while I'm playing D and D. So I feel like I've I've galaxy brained myself right now. Oh, it's yeah. very good. Oh hell yeah! I've like focused my dumb brain onto a thing with my hands, so my my brain is hyper focused Damn. on our D and D. Damn. And I have a little bit of a lazy old fashioned in my system. Oh hell yeah! Nice. I didn't get enough sleep last night, and it's been real busy. <laughs> Hell but, yeah. But we're having fun. And we're having I like fun. that. I am just loving this prison arc so much, Michael. <laughs> it's like, really dumb. It's really fucking it's fun. It's so fun. I kind of I... don't want it to end. Or or I want to revisit it somehow because <laughs> it's just so fucking you fun. You get arrested again. Or we play different characters in the prison again. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm just, <laughs> I just, for some reason, I love this, this uh, mythical prison we have two and a half levels of content remaining i agree we should you know go back to the i mean like as a side thing if we did something sure i don't know sure. um hey michael can i also yeah. say something yeah. sure buddy. can i thank your wife for helping you make the podcast yeah, good shit, same uh yeah you can because i bounce ideas off her and she comes up with half the shit most of the time <laughs> there you go so thank you carly thanks carly well, I don't. I literally would be dead otherwise. Um, <laughs> man, what a day, huh? Who wants to play some D and D? Thursday. Well, I, I can only assume Rowan and I are dead. So this is the uh, yeah the t Tim and Nika show. R.I.P. Finally, <laughs> finally, you guys. The fans have though. been asking yeah. for it. <laughs> They've been asking for a Rowan and Scud to die for all this time. That is weird. As soon as uh, Rowan showed up, they're like, "Kill Scud and Rowan." Yeah. Y'all been asking for two things, and that's Jimmy Neutron and Smash, and for it to be just Nika and Tim on the show, and we're happy and to now... deliver. They've actually been asking for Bachman and Nika since the Buddy Cop episode. That's fair, yeah. <laughs> I got Wait. one, so... Take it away, Tim. Well, I wasn't there me? for most of the episode, but ah! I'm pretty sure Rowan <laughs> died, and Scott died. You don't know uh, that! On my Did side of things... What? Wait, everyone has to roll. Did everyone roll? No, I rolled a 15. Somebody, somebody else rolled. Roll oh, I rolled a 19. That's not a one. Still I, not a thing. I rolled a one and a two next to each other. Uh -huh. Oh, man. So it's what happened one. last week on the Drunks and Dragons 5th edition actual play? All right. Podcast. Toby made the potion. It will be ready tomorrow as per the start of the recap. Um, uh, 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 Lonnie made better friends with Bercy. And um, uh, uh, did, did rumor telling and stuff like that. Uh, I'm going to tell what I think happened based on Jennifer screaming. 
You've gotten pretty good at like interpreting my my screaming over yeah. these years together. So she, there must have been some real long complication because she had to jump up. Uh, I think the phrase "I want to see how this bean plan plays out" was said. <laughs> I like that a lot. That was yeah, good. That happened. That um, then she jumped in the 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 lap of the the the, the chair. Mm -hmm. of the boss and stab him but my mm -hmm. assumption is you probably pulled some like rules as, as written bullshit and made her roll just a d4 which is both correct and dumb as hell and i respect it uh i believe the boss had the antidote uh and then they got thrown down a hole as um uh, rowan did a mufasa scrape against the, the wall there were also several orcs in the room <laughs> That is actually There's very good. Orcs. Yeah, as well as happening, which we didn't know initially. Cool. Yeah, so that didn't go. I'm cracking open a delicious Michelob Ultra. Oh, <laughs> Nick, this, this is Nick for you. Yeah, I, we, I, I have a question. What do you? What yeah. is everyone drinking tonight? Oh, I'm drinking a lazy person's old fashioned, which is I just glugged a bunch of bourbon into uh, a glass with some syrup that like some uh tiki bitters. syrup that oh, was yeah. in the fridge that was like grapefruit cinnamon and some bitters it's good so that's that not wonderful I'm, I'm drinking a leftover polar seltzer mm. uh, from that's hydrating <laughs> Uh, I'm drinking a leftover Mick Ultra from PAX, but I just finished a half leftover lime polar seltzer, half, um, or I guess quarter, um, gin with a whole bunch of fucking bitters in it. This guy loves bitters. What about our other friends? Bachman Dad, what are you Bachman drinking? Daddy. I've got. I mean, I feel like I'm a broken record, but uh, since I've been since I've been dieting and doing that thing, I've just been smashing the Trulies. And what are Trulies? What is that? True. It's a. It's like a, a Lacroix, but it'll get you drunk. Oh, nice. what are they oh God. really? Spike seltzer situation, but there's White another. Wolf? There's what are they yeah, it's White, White Claw. White yeah, Claw. White, White Claw, and then uh, Truly are the two that that I've had. I think they'll um, fuck you up, which is weird. What? Yeah, yeah. Flavor... Rain doesn't understand it. Grapefruit it's... and pomelo is this one. That sounds fucking good. Ooh, yeah. I so love it. The good only citrus. the only Lacroix that I've really been able to get stinky on are the um, are the grapefruit and then or like the tangerine. I guess it is. Mm. Is it orange or tangerine? Because I'm pretty both. sure it's, I'm pretty sure it's tangerine. Yeah, it's and one tastes the... like dog shit. The other is really good. Right, exactly. That's why it's not orange. Um, but this one, like, they've got <laughs> grapefruit and they've got blood orange, and the blood orange Ooh, is, blood is really good. good. Yeah. Do yourself a favor and go get yourself. What was it? Polar like unicorn uh, parts or unicorn dragon den? Kisses? I think it was unicorn yeah. kisses and dragon tears. My favorite one is the unicorn Yeti kisses. kisses at night. <laughs> Um, Polar is really killing it on the flavors, that's for sure. We got that in the great, the great land of New England. And then the next morning, the uh, Toby and oh, yeah. the uh, Lonnie met up, realized oh, yeah, that yeah. their friends were missing, and then we started fucking with Jimmy Skaggs, and then the uh, smoke did happen. Uh, we both rolled poorly, and he squirted his way away from us. <laughs> He pee peed, I think. He pee peed a little bit. He, he did pee peed. Pee -pee we did um, totally nail our first intimidation. Scared the shit oh. out of him. Yeah, like yeah. I just want to say, like, the piss out of him. Too much, actually. Scared him too much. Yeah, we need to pull it back. Pull it back. Yes. Yes. Mm hmm. <laughs> that um, happened. That happened. <laughs> Great. So. I think uh, you guys have your normal work details. For and... those of us not wait, 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 yeah, no, no, no. What's a smoke bomb? Oh, did he do it? Yeah, he, he, he dropped a smoke. Oh, okay. I thought something more fucked up was happening. Okay, that's totally fine. You you did your um, cliffhanger thing. It's like, oh, no. It, what you thought was happening was actually happening, whenever, which is fine. Whenever the, the smoke clears, can Lonnie and Toby be holding their own, like, each other's hands? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I'm like, like, I got him. <laughs> I got him. I got him. Oh Toby, no, Toby. I think we should we should go and maybe 
try to find Scud and Rowan before things get real bad. I agree, but we should wait like uh, an hour and a half. Don't you think we should find him now before the no. potion? No, because if I if we have the potion, I won't be useless. And right now, I don't want to be ru rude, but you're so good at punching and I'm just so... I can't do anything. You saw me when I tried to punch all of them. They kept spiking me into the trash into the ground. I tried to train with Jayla, but I just... He kicks a bean on the ground. Oh, no. I'm just so gosh darn useless without my powers. Toby, no. No, I just want to I just want to say to you the only time you've ever failed is whenever you've stood in the way of yourself. You can achieve anything that you want and all you got to do is put your big old brain to it and I know you got the biggest brain of any play anyone in here in this whole place. You're smarter than anyone and you don't need no magic to do anything. Shit. You made these <laughs> beans. You made beans out of the trash taste better than possum pie. Uh, Ain't uh, nobody and, ever done that before. Uh, if I could, if I could just break in here, it's Percy. Uh, Hi, Percy. Uh, Toby, don't, ah! don't don't believe in yourself. Believe in me. Believing in you. <laughs> oh my gosh! Even though you are a villain, you're very famous to me. Can I get your hand, your your autograph, written in bean paste? <laughs> sure. He draws an X. In well, being paced. Okay, this does look at your look like yours. I like it. Uh, uh, and, and Toby has extremely puss in boots eyes uh, <laughs> as, as he pets himself up and says, "Yeah, okay, but I'm still gonna wait an hour and a half." <laughs> yeah, that's probably for the best. <laughs> I mean, I I could do it now. I don't want to be a doubter, but just logically, you know, what if if we get that some hijinks? I'm, you know. The right? guards are, are rounding you up to send you to your work. Right, and so we don't have to, like, fight these guards right now. Don't push me. Um, and you go off to your works. I do it. Do you guys, do you want to do anything special at your works, or? I go, I go to the laundry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Michael. Yes. So, my brain just did something stupid, and I'm going to try it. I'm, we're going to talk it out and work it together. I just <laughs> now realized that we're in a medieval society, so mm -hmm. we probably don't have a like gas burner. We probably have like logs and stuff like that, right? Yes. And there might be some weird magic, whatever. Toby would like to rig uh, somehow a fire to happen so that he can scooch out at the end of the uh, shift. So whether he has to close the like smoke smoke flute is that what it's called? Flu 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 I think flu. Yeah. Um, I'm from Florida where it's always hot. Uh, <laughs> yeah, or if we have to just get fucking basic as shit, if I just have to like light something on fire uh, off in the corner like a greasy rag, yeah, but away from everybody. Like you could definitely start like an oil fire too. Like okay, yeah, I, I think towards the end oil. of our shift, as we're getting, um, as I can kind of hear the clomp, clomp, clomp of the guards um, moving everybody out, I'm gonna hold back just a, the perfect amount of seconds using my 23 intelligence, and then start a fire. And then um, I don't think I have any smoke bombs, but give me um, an intelligent roll, but with advantage. For you, anything, my brother. I don't think this is super hard for Toby. Can I roll again? <laughs> advantage. Can I have super advantage? They're both yeah, bad. What did you? Well, I rolled six. Let me look to see what my. Uh, so uh, my intelligence bonus is is six, and my uh, proficiency is six. Mm -hmm. So eighteen if you go that route, or twelve if you don't have my proficiency. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, so you're, you want to cause a distraction by starting a fire, right? Yes. Um, so I think that is, that is definitely within your power, especially with an 18. Um, and yeah, you like this, sh you burn this fucking place down. Damn. That's huge. And I want to, I, I definitely push my brother. I definitely put, uh, push, uh, Scarlet, Ginger, wait, Scarlet away and Ginger, uh, and Ruby. What about, what about Rusty? Uh, I don't have red names. No. 
Um, they all have red hair too. We, yeah, we, we um... established that, right? Yeah. And they're all gnomes, right? It's like a room full of Tobies, essentially. <laughs> and I'm only related to one, which is, yeah. Uh, I don't push Rose, Rusty, but I also don't try to get Rusty uh, murdered by me. I don't want to murder him at all. If he's close to it, Michael, um, I will try to save him, though. Um, you're good. They, they, everyone's, they're like, ah! And they, um, everyone starts freaking out. Guards come running in. And uh, I think you're able to slip out. Uh, I didn't need to do that. I just wanted them to be distracted longer. Classic D and D move of create a distraction. It's fun. Direct. It's fun for everyone. Sowing chaos. <laughs> Is it spring? Because I'm sowing chaos. <laughs> <laughs> that was what so are these? <laughs> I'm on a roll tonight. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Happy to this more often. I think it's good. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so you want to head back to your head back I think, to my room and chug, 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 and then um, get some of the, the vials of potion for the rest of the crew. Um, I want to how, uh, but uh, how many, uh, 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 <laughs> if anyone, Michael, do you know what, do you know what I'm doing? Right? I go, well, have, have you, you heard that you yet? Know that character in Comedy Big Man? Okay, it's Alan Thick, Alan- <laughs> played by Paul F. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing that ways for like almost the entire run of our show, but uh, <laughs> whenever I think and I do that, it's Alan Thick. It's very funny. Uh, uh, comedy being great. Um, yeah, how many uh, servings of potion do I have? You have enough for everybody. What are and the nutrition no, facts on that potion? Yeah, well, how many carbs? How many are carbs? <laughs> well, you plug it, and it does not taste good. Um, yeah. You think you got it pretty good, but you didn't quite perfectly nail uh, the potion. It's some more um, beans, but I'll hold off. And okay. uh, you do, uh, you know, you, your face turns red and steam comes out your ears. <laughs> and um, you just feel weird and bad because it essentially is changing your blood chemistry. Ooh. Um, got fucked up blood now. Got fucked up blood. Um. And uh, not permanently, but you know. Can, oh, okay, I, I was like, are we gonna do the anime thing where we just tell everybody that our character's uh, blood type? Yeah, uh, you're AB negative. No, I'm uh, positive. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. Did Toby do uh, a test? <laughs> and you feel you can feel your powers, some of your powers coming back to you. Yeah, uh, Toby is, uh, if possible. Uh, throwing back and forth a small thing of fire in his hands to test out his uh, cantrips. Am um, I with you, or are you doing this privately? You can, you can be. You can. I, have gone. I would like to. I think that I would um, tell Bercy, just be like, Bercy, I, I would really like if you could just do me a real solid. I'm going to talk to Toby about you being in the Tower of Grey, and we'll help you get out of here. But do you think you'd cover my shift at the library today? <laughs> uh, Sure. Okay, thank you. Not really a lot to do. Uh, basically, what I was asking is, can we give some of the other NPCs some of the potion? To try to what? beef them up a bit? Like which ones? Like Steiner? Like... Wait, oh. your roommate or Duncan? Steiner or Ulf. Okay. He's, he's an alchemist, but he doesn't have okay. a lot of... Like, he's not going to be helpful. Okay. Uh-oh. Nick has a plan. <laughs> no, I just <laughs> thought of something that I wanted to do before I forgot. Like, But it is not related at all. <laughs> okay. I, in, my ta- in my spare time, can I just tell you real fast, Michael? Yeah, of course. <laughs> and, and we can circle back around to it whenever it's applicable. Mm-hmm. In Lonnie's spare time, she would want to read The Scarlet Harlot really, really fast. Because that's a thing <laughs> she can do. She can read really, really fast. <laughs> I um, can't. <laughs> <laughs> and sure. um, and then she'd like to like maybe drop a very iconic Scarlet Harlot line to Steimer Duncan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't need to happen anytime soon. I just okay. let's, let's keep that marinating let's in the a, back of our minds. Let's put a pin in that one. Yeah. I think I think you drop that line as you're going by him, and his eyebrows <sighs> are go flying up in the air, and he's he takes off. Uh, 
he's running he, like he's running the other direction with a bucket of water. Um, Not in a sexual way, just as like a I know what you I know like. the series. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, Let's uh, bond. I know what Steiner's like. <laughs> I know what Steiner's watch. <laughs> I know what Steiner's <laughs> like. Uh, okay, yeah. So I I pass fire back and forth. I try to mend a little bit of our blanket. Uh, Toby, you realize that you can cast up to fourth level spells. Dope. Yes, 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 yes. You can. Yes. You have all your spell slots, so if you want, you can cast like a first level spell at a higher level if you so choose to. Okay. Yeah, because you can trade down. So mm-hmm. I can use my eighth level spell to cast alarm. Mm-hmm. Cool. Uh, yeah, Toby's just like fucking like running around in a circle, and I, I I run over to snatch, and I'm like, look, and uh, I I cast uh, an image of our parents. I cast an image of the dinner uh, that we had the night that Aludra, Jayla, uh, Jet, and I. Um, Was it the all... jerk yurt? No, no, no. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, was it Jet or Steve? I think it was Jet. Uh, where it, well, Jerry came over there too. <laughs> Man, what, what, Jerry? What, what was the first Damn. night that we went to my parents' house? Oh, uh, Jerry was definitely there. Yeah. Yeah, he stole your bed. Yeah. Okay. So I guess we found out. I guess we did not go to my house before we went to the White Spire. Man, that was a million years ago. It was really very, very long. All ago. right. Well, I, 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 I do an image of uh, uh, the cantrip of. Of that, nice. So, like, he the starts tush. crying. Oh, like I miss it so much. I don't remember if my brother has magic. I don't think he does, but um, I want to give him just a, a tiny ki- kiss of the potion. Um, he goes, ah, "This is awful. It's not as nearly as good as your beans." <laughs> so true. And my logic here is even if he's not a, a, a magic caster, a, in case there are any um, defenses based mm. on it. Uh, you I gotta give, watch out for your bro bro. Exactly. I give Lonnie the potion. Again, also I, not I'm a magic drinking. person. I'm hoping that maybe uh, maybe it'll just be like a real strong absinthe or something. Like Lonnie just in life, Lonnie just wants to have fun and get fucked up and learn secrets about our friends and be Hell inspiring. Yeah. <laughs> it's really not heroin in days, so it's true. I'm like Johnson. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> hit those veins. <laughs> what? <laughs> She's thirsty. Oh yes, that's her. Uh, so what is the, so what is the plan now? The plan now is to go to Scud's room, go behind <laughs> the Kid Rock poster from the... 2011 Born to Live Free tour. Born to Live Free. Uh-huh. Or Born Free 2011 Born, right. poster. Yeah. yeah. Uh, poster. Go down through there and then kind of wing it? Is that sound right? <laughs> well, That's kind of what like... we did. <laughs> Here, Toby, I think that maybe we could come up with a little better plan than that, but if you want to wing it, I got two elbows and two chicken wings. <laughs> That's what we say. That's you got two elbows. You got two two chicken wings. That's the old Kaplan saying. What are you saying? Oh hell, it never made sense. But it really makes sense if you just think about it. Let's just run right in there and just All punch right. the fuck and out of everyone. <laughs> no, I have a better idea. Which we're gonna wing it, of course, and punch the fuck out of everyone, of course. Uh, but we know there's pro- probably a hole. So how about this? And uh, can we? This is like in running motion in the cartoon. Mm-hmm. Um, as soon as we get to the poster, I cast invisibility on both Lonnie and I. Ooh. Okay, because this is within a uh, jail cell, right? So you can't just really waltz in. Oh, okay. If we're invisible, okay, then we I will, through... as soon as I see the fuzz, I will cast it. Okay. If we're invisible, can we go through solid things? What? (laughs) Like, what? (laughs) 
<laughs> like, if you're invisible, do the laws of physics still apply to you? Can you walk through prison bars? No, Can Michael, you... that's a great question. What is gaseous? If you were in a gaseous form, you could do that, right? So or... just because we are invisible does not mean we can go... If phase might be a word you could say. Through things. I love this. <laughs> is this a flash thing? <laughs> what if we tried to run really fast and face through it? Yeah. <laughs> no, but that is. <laughs> Nika, I've never felt more connected with you since you did Lonnie because you started watching The Flash, <laughs> and the first thing you did was make a speedster character. I started watching The Flash, and the first thing I did was go on uh, was go on Villains Underground and make a speedster character. <laughs> Oh my god, you are my reverse flash. You're my oh, no. <laughs> RPM R was a villain, so... Damn. Fuck. Bachman and I are connected in a truly <laughs> biblical way. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, we're invisible for the next <laughs> hour. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, we want to do it as, as soon as we see someone that we have to sneak by. Let's get rid of this Sneaking challenge, let's be completely invisible. I'm like, it feels so goddamn. You're invisible and sneaking around. Mm -hmm. I have to tell you, Toby, this is the most fun because I like being sneaky, but this is like being extra sneaky. Yeah. But they can hear us, so be careful. Oh, hell. Oh, hell. I agree. I, I talked to you. Shit. <laughs> you say fourth level, Michael? Mm hmm. Okay, yeah, we sneak past is what uh, we're planning to get to the Kid Rock poster. You get to Scud and uh, Jimmy's cell, and it's locked. Jimmy's right. not inside. He must be at lunch. He, he left. He's doing his pee-pee laundry. <laughs> um... Uh, Lottie, can you? Are you good at picking locks? You know, I don't think I've ever tried, but <laughs> hey, but let's, let's try. What what uh, kind of check would that be, Michael? Sleight of hand. Oh well, Toby, you know I'm mediocrely good at this. Okay, I believe in you. I rolled a sixteen plus five, so a twenty-one. Whoa! Nice. Uh, you take out a hairpin, I guess, and fishbone. <laughs> I look right. at uh, Toby and I'm like, I had never done this before. And she can make, make maintains eye contact with Toby, clicks the lock undone. Oh, loud clicking noise, and the door swings open. I need to get that knock spell. Bingo. <laughs> How the hell did you do that so fast? Oh, you know what they say. It's just beginner's look. Don't ask me to do it again, but if you do, I'd love to try because I am up for a challenge. Okay. <laughs> well, that was great, Lonnie. Very good. We continue on through the poster hole. The hey, we, we continue on into Kid Rock's hole. <laughs> you penetrate Kid Rock's hole. And, Where no one uh, has been before. And uh, you're in a weird prison-y back hallway-ish narrow area that clearly people aren't supposed to be in <laughs> and you follow it down a little ways and We're you get to you're still invisible you get to a uh a weirdly opulent door okay what's it made and out it of it's made out of a uh a rich exotic wood Ooh, Ooh. an <laughs> ebony or uh I don't know. Ivory. Or an ivory. <laughs> Ooh, baby. <laughs> okay. Um, Lonnie, try to open the door. But check for traps. Okay. I I check for traps, Michael. Oh, do you? I do. What does that involve? <laughs> <laughs> Would that also be a sleight of hand? Or maybe uh, a survival? A stealth. Definitely all those. Perception, you whisper into the mic as I roll my dice across the table. Streetwise. <laughs> I have this trap book, and this oftentimes, you know. Do you want me to sense motive the floor? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I'm going to get in trouble. I did like that the Pathfinder playtest did not have sense motive. I like, was so mad about get that. Fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to die. <laughs> um. Roll and investigate. 
I don't know how I am at that. Wait, I'll roll an investigate. I have a negative one, so yeah. Can I aid Toby? Sure. Okay. I say, Toby, I'll pick this lock. Maybe you better check and see. I got a 12. I don't think that hits, but I'm not the DM. You don't see any traps. That's, you don't see any traps. What's Wait, happening? Toby, Toby, I was aiding you to look for traps. Oh, you're oh. muted. Oh, we can't hear you. The thing, yeah, your mic did the thing again. Well, last time it was appearing. Well, but it was also the microphone, and then they muted appear in. Oh. That's weird. They're making bad noise faces. Yeah. I hope they didn't fuck up their recording. I wish I was better at reading lips. I can read fuck really well. Shit. Any of the curses have got those down. I'm so bad at reading lips. I'm lip blind. I'm a nosy Nicole, so wow. I'm a nosy Nika. David Allen, please cut out where I said my real name. <laughs> <laughs> As if no one could guess. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I drank a bottle of wine, so I got drunk. <laughs> Tim and Jennifer's computer did a bad. Uh-oh. You've got the muted icon now. Rockman, who are you most um, excited to play in Smash? Hmm. I want to play the I want to play Piranha Plant, but it's not going to be out at launch. Um, I'm really I'm really horny for um, hello. The You're Day. back. <laughs> our our audacity did weird. Well. Basically, I think Tim whapped the microphone. I whapped it. Oh no! It was don't so whap it. Where it got to. So, don't, don't honk your microphone. Stop honking it. I think it was right there. I, I think it, yeah. I think it basically stopped when our microphone. Stop oh. honking your beefus. Yeah, that's left <laughs> we, we were waiting for, to hear if Toby was uh, checking for traps. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you didn't hear my dog shit rule. Hell yeah. Hey. All right, so my audacity did break, by the way. But okay. not not super far back. Okay. Um, basically in that same. So I'm just going to start my audacity now again? Yeah, I think that's probably the best way. Okay, is there... Do we want to count? Yeah. We count. And it count and do a clamp. So... Uh, one. Two. So two. Do we need, all need to clap? <laughs> Just for my own. Yeah, everyone say numbers. All right, Michael, you're one. I'm two. Nika, you're three. Bachman, you're four. Okay, thank you. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. <laughs> okay, one. now let's do a clap on a uh, go. Clap. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. How come Jennifer didn't get to count? That was electric. Did anyone else feel that? I'm in, we're in the same zone. I don't care. Yeah. All right. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say go, but on go hit hit it. So three, two, one. I think we did it. Sure. <laughs> I mean okay, it so uh, he can do anything. So Michael, did Toby get advantage on his role? Uh, you had a 12, right? I think that would give you an advantage. Perfect. You're wonderful. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Michael. Thank you. You look great today. We, we love Although, you. Don't you Good still, like, have proficiency in the skill to give somebody else advantage? No. That. What is it? <laughs> Investigate? I don't... I don't... I, 
Michael, I think that's unfair to penalize someone who doesn't have a high intelligence <laughs> to have to have proficiency in investigate. Lonnie's not smart, but <laughs> darn she's it, so wise. Her, and her heart's in the right place. Look, can't that count for something? <laughs> if I have advantage, I have a 23. If I don't, I think I got a 12. Um, chat room, tell us what the rules are. Just look Chara up age rules. or sister or something. I can't touch my microphone or my keyboard. No, because I'll break it again. Fear of the microphone breaking again. Oh, I think we switched it. So now, <laughs> I think whenever you guys left, I am currently Tim Lanning and Jennifer <laughs> Cheek. <laughs> Good. Nice. The dream. First, you slept in our closet. Now you steal. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I, I love it. to sleep in. I am the monster that sleeps in Tim and Jennifer's closet. I miss when Nick was in our closet and we all could listen to the water run in the Airbnb <laughs> yeah. together. But it's all constantly tooted. <laughs> yeah. Did too. we do that? Don't say. Don't don't listen. Say it on there. <laughs> if it happens, oh. it happens. Yeah, I'm gonna happen. What stays in wait, happens in the Airbnb safe? <laughs> oh, Michael, do I get my luck points back? Uh, no, you don't have your your item. It's not an item. It's a, it's a feat. Oh, it's a feat? Yeah. I probably had it the whole time, to be honest with you, but, you know, I gave you the ba the, the Benny. You know what I'm saying? The Benny. You can lend your aid to another creature in the completion of a task when you take the help action. The creature you aid gains advantage in the next ability to check. It makes to perform the task you're helping with, provided that it makes the check before the start of your next turn. That doesn't say anything about proficiency, but then the chat that room... That's too easy. But then the chat room was like... You need proficiency, right? Isn't that what they said? What is the chat? No. Since when do we listen to them? Why do we listen to them? I I think you. Pr I think if you want to be a stickler, Nika could not have picked that last lock. Yeah, probably. Mike, are, Tim, There's almost zero percent chance. Away from I think me. you both need proficiency and sleight of hand. And I do have. Really no, no, no. Tools. Tools. I do have. Uh, I have proficiency <laughs> in stealth, which is yeah. right below sleight of hand. It is, yeah, she's so not wrong. Is true. It is. That's the what is it? The next two skill uh, rule. <laughs> the next uh, skill. Yeah, it's, it's the in the adjacent mid too. <laughs> I'm gonna take a five foot movement to the stealth skill <laughs> instead of the sleight of hand. Please let this uh, happen, Michael. Beans. I've never picked a lock on D and D. <laughs> I'm sure yeah, Michael didn't want to slow true. us down with that, but you know, I didn't. But here we are. Here we are. All right. Well, we're past the door. What are we doing with this trap? Uh, you don't sense any traps. But perfect, baby. I think we should steal that Pathfinder thing where you make checks for us. That is fun, isn't it? It is fun. We did a thing sort of like that when you guys were had your headphones off. Mm. Mike Bachman hated it. Yeah, he got <laughs> a little stressed out. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> It was great. It was good fun. It was pretty funny. Good content. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, try to... It doesn't seem trapped. Try to open the door. Try to open the door. Now, are you throwing the door open? Or are you quietly trying to sneakily open the door? What, what you up sneakily, to? Sneakily. I would like to stealthfully open the door. All right, roll stealth for me. Of which I am trained in. And we're invisible. You are invisible. That is okay. true. Does that give me a bonus? I rolled a 7 plus 11, so I do have an 18. But if I get an invisibility bonus, I would like to add that in as well. Why? Why? Why does everyone want to know? Minimum advantage. At why the does minimum. everyone want to know rules this episode? <laughs> <laughs> I believe, as written, it doesn't. It literally does not say. Yeah, the invisibility spell doesn't say, but I think it's on you to... to, to Let's say I get an extra plus 10. I'm invisible. Uh, it's like half cover, right? You can have... Let's give you advantage. David, okay. cut all of this out. Make it sound like we know exactly what we're doing. We're super okay. <laughs> Well, I rolled a 4 on my advantage roll, so I'm going to take the 7 and get an 18. Okay. To stealthfully um, open the door. You open the door and it goes... <laughs> <laughs> it makes a bit of a creaking noise. Damn. I shut it and try again. <laughs> Do you really? I don't know. It can only get better, right? What? I look what? at Toby. What are you doing? 
very long. That's very funny. Oh, oh, we door, can be quieter next time. <laughs> currently, the door is slightly ajar, and you hear footsteps coming towards it. I shut the door. I shut the door. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to. I want to shut the door and try again. No, I grab Loni's other arm and I pull her off the side. <laughs> you hear what the hell? Okay, wait, Toby, I just hear me. I cast a minor illusion, and it's Jimmy Skaggs, and he, and he says, "Hey, man, I can't open the door. I got, I got piss on my britches." <laughs> and Giant Skaggs' voice. Oh my god. The um, the uh, <laughs> the door swings open wide and two extremely large half orcs um stomp out and, and i pull lonnie behind them is um so did you make an image of jimmy skaggs just or a sound. Just, a sound. just a sound yeah and, and then uh, i cast it again uh because uh, the, the cantrip version of it uh hmm. out through the um um, the, the like prison. I, I actually don't know where we are right now. Uh, down you're, the hall a bit. In the, you're in like a, like a weird, weird area. secret area. Yeah. So I cast it a little farther down and, with it saying, Ah, oh, geez, I'm sorry, fellas. Can you um, uh, walk towards me a bit? I, I, I cover my shame. <laughs> I'm covered in piss. I'm a fucking piss doer. <laughs> God damn it, Jimmy. First, it was last night, and now again. Jesus I love, fucking Christ. I love to piss. I love to Jimmy, piss. God I damn love, it. Toby, Toby say he's a thirsty boy. I'm so fucking thirsty, I drink my pee. I drink goes the pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> um, the one half orc looks at the other one and goes, you go ahead, I'll take care of this. And one stomps off down the hallway, and the other one is uh, now. During this, were you guys slipping in, or slipping were in. you? Oh, should we? I was. Yeah. I, I was just going to ask if you wanted me to punch the fuck out of no, him. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> Michael's going to rules us, and if you punch, okay. he's going to allow you to roll two d8 on a fifty-seven hit point monster. No thanks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fair. We'll sneak in. Okay, you guys slip in. Uh, I'll say you were able to to do it without any trouble because uh, you are very invisible. And um, he closes the door and uh, and he goes, "Sorry, boss. This fucking Jimmy pissed himself again." <laughs> and. Okay. Uh, and you uh, you see the 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 boss. He's sitting in his chair. He has a bandage over his neck, and um, he is holding the intricate dagger that you recognize from uh, Scud and having before from Scud having it. It was the, the Scud's have dagger before. from Scud. <laughs> okay. Damn. And, uh, How high is the ceiling? What's that? How high is the ceiling? The ceiling is probably, it's actually pretty high. It's like a good, probably 15-ish feet. Um, it's, it's a weirdly opulent room. It is. Uh, it has paneled wooden walls and shag carpet. And um, the boss is sitting in a high-backed wooden chair, which swivels somehow. What? Um, that has been admitted. Is he holding a, a white cat? <laughs> he, um, he is not, but he is. Uh, he is playing with this dagger, um, and uh, and the. I don't know why this is the other detail that I keep saying. But next to him is a what appears to be a bar, one of those globe bars. You know, you know, it, you know like yeah, a globe where the globe comes half and up you, like, and there's liquid up, inside. And inside, yeah. there's a bunch of like. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Um, yeah, but we're still invisible, and he can't see us. Yeah, you can't see. You're invisible. I All right, so we don't. We know that probably they're tossed on this hole. We don't know. You don't see a hole. Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah, you just know that from meta gaming. No, no, no. What if... Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, Jimmy. Jimmy Scott told us. Oh, I guess he did say the hole. I know. So right. I know directly that you mafosed it down the hole from meta gaming, but. <laughs> What if? But Toby and I can see each other. Mm, I don't think 
I don't think we can. Okay. Hands or something. Yeah, I don't think it like puts us in the ring wraith world. <laughs> Shit. I was really hoping that maybe we could, yeah, see our blurry images from across the <laughs> room. So what if we just hap like happen to bump into each other? Well, I definitely have hold of your hand. Oh, okay, so we are Aww. holding on to each other. Okay, so I give Toby Never five go, squeezes, <laughs> which means in Lonnie speak, should we kill? Should we kill the boss? That's five uh, words. That five, five in Lonnie speak. Five <laughs> pulses. Mm -hmm. um, Toby might not know what that means, but Lonnie pulses Toby's hand five smart. times. Toby, roll insight. You got it, brother. I'm really. How much does Toby know Lonnie speak? Let me pass that secret I message. Plus one insight, so. <laughs> Ooh, that's cocked. You agree that's cocked, right? Oh, it's a four. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it definitely was cocked. Though. It was cocked, but then I moved it, and it. Well, I was cocked. We it's all. Cocked. We, we roll up. We roll it. It was I cocked. Shouldn't roll up in my hand. That's stupid. Uh, do 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 do. Roll on even start. Okay, there you go. Sixteen. It would have been an an eighteen before. Too. Um, you don't get it word for word, Lonnie speak, but you get the feeling that she wants to kill this guy. Yeah, I, my assumption is it's like an, an assistant. Like maybe if I don't Let's even feel like, oh, can I kill this guy? It's like let me do something. Let me do something. Um, you feel the speed force kind of pulsing in Lonnie, like she needs to go fast. And, Lo and Lonnie's probably <laughs> vibrating so hard she's going through my hand a few times. It's true, phasing um, in and out. Dogs in her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so, Michael, there is a bloody necked fella and a large a orc. Huh? A large orc. Yes, he's got a bandage on his neck. Roll perception for me. For you, both of us or just Toby? Yeah, both of you. Fucking shit. Uh, four? Is that good? No, it's bad. I got a 21 perception. That's better. Um, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Um, <laughs> Tim, take off your headphones for one second. Okay. <laughs> Lonnie, you notice a comically large button on the arm of the chair that the boss is sitting in. Oh, I push it. No, <laughs> you know when you're, you're not near him. Oh, well, but can I walk? I'm invisible, right? You can. You can. Tim, come back. Okay, <laughs> I I start to pull Toby closer. And I push the button. What button? <laughs> uh, so, if, so he's literally sitting in this chair. So you're gonna have to essentially like climb over him. Let me be wise about this. I want to be, you know, if this is like a, a wing back chair, Lonnie uh -huh. is. Um, you said it swivels in a way that it doesn't. Uh, she locks the bottom of the chair so it won't lean back. <laughs> Climbs onto it. That's very... for sure a stealth roll to lock the chair. I'll make, it. I'll, make it. I'll make it. I'll make it. I'll give a fuck. I got a twenty-five stealth Damn. roll. Damn. All right. The, so there's she... a, a magically a locking mechanism appears, <laughs> so and she locks it is it invented canonically, and you lock yep. it in place. She holds mm -hmm. on to the back of it so that, like, the weight is so dis or distributed so equally between the boss sitting in the chair and Lonnie and Toby. She she's baby Bjorning Toby <laughs> at this point because she and doesn't. Toby want... just like looks around like I guess I'm flying. <laughs> she doesn't want anything to happen to him. So they're baby Bjorning onto the back of this chair, and she reaches around and pushes the button. <gasps> um, a giant. Trap door opens right in front of this chair, and uh, and the boss like jumps like half a foot, <laughs> and he goes, "God damn it, not again! <laughs> Got to get the gnomes back in here to fix this shit. Every time I set it off, it doesn't reset the right way." Jimmy, <laughs> and then she pokes Toby. <laughs> um. He gets up and starts walking towards the door. Okay, okay. I cast uh, Major Image, uh, which is the door um, closing, and I infuse it with Shadowfell uh, so that it feels real. And I want, because what I want him to do is I want him to, to touch it, and then I want to get rid of the Major Image. I'm telling you my whole plan. I want to make it l appear as though the door is shutting the way that is normal. And then as soon as he goes over to like fix it or touch it or whatever, 
uh, I want to dismiss Major Image and have him tumble all the way down. Um, all right. That's uh, what I want to do. How is this? So, okay, so you can do that. I guess it's just a matter of if he would do something dumb enough. <laughs> like, because... If if there's a malfunctioning door, right? Yeah. You're not gonna like a malfunctioning trap door that falls into that opens up into. You're not gonna like stand the top pit. Of it. Yeah. Yeah. That's... You're not gonna run over and like jump up and down. All right. How about this? How about this? I cast. I need more spells <laughs> to push people. Uh, I cast blindness. Okay. Uh, the closest that they get to the door i cast blindness so they need to make a constitution 20 saving throw now if you cast an offensive spell on somebody don't you become visible is that a thing uh i'm not sure i actually am gonna go ahead and cast this at third level targeting the orc too okay since he's ba baby bjorn does my invisible body hide his visible body no damn it definitely not all right, so it actually ends on me because I cast a spell. So, uh, you, they if they make the twenty con save, they will see a floating, luxurious uh, Toby. Um, they both fail. Okay, they're blind. Ah! Uh, and, and I think push over the push 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 the boss down the hole. I push the boss down the hole <laughs> in a flash. Lonnie jumps off the back of the chair, very delicately setting Toby into the chair, Ooh, like runs it. around, and then Leonidas style kicks the boss yeah. down into. Um, so normally this would be a strength contest. Can I be uh, a dex? But he <laughs> is blinded, and you could maybe let's say let's say you can do a dex roll um, against his strength, and you're gonna tr to try to like trip him up, like judo is, toss him. This is yeah. like a saving throw, right? Well, can I like maybe she comes around and like she literally whizzes around so that she's in between him and the door, and the pit is behind, and she goes to punch him. So that's why it's dex for her. Okay. Explain it. All of it. Oh fuck. Michael. Uh-huh. What'd you pulled roll? A pulled a real Jennifer here. Wow. <laughs> I rolled in that one. No! I have a 12. No. <laughs> uh, do I have inspiration? Um, Can you well, roll a dex for me? A, me a saving dex. throw or just a... Dex. Uh, roll uh, acrobatics. Okay, I rolled a 14. This is looking better. I think acrobatics is decent. Acrobatics is plus 11, so a 25. Um, so when you go toppling over after missing him so horrifically, no. uh, and you, uh, you start to fall down the hole, um, but you're able to grab onto the edge as you're falling. Here's the thing about drunk bunks. We don't always do it right, but sometimes we get lucky. <laughs> um, and you're, you're holding on to the side. He goes, what the hell was that? Why am I blind? Ah! <laughs> um, but you're, you're very agile. You could just scamper back up. Okay, I do, please. Whenever There's a big time. hole here or there, and it's very dark, and you can't see down very far. So he doesn't fall down? No. No one fell down the hole. Can I try again? <laughs> I, you, could, uh, you could have one more shot at it, I'd say. <laughs> okay. He, he's just, like, sort of groping around right now. Michael, you're too nice to me. Thank you. I'll remember this next time I try to phase through something. Nika remembers. <laughs> Nika will remember that. <laughs> On this, the day of my Toby's <laughs> Lava's wedding. Toby's father's wedding. I got a uh, That's a an inside summer. joke. That's inside joke. I'm sorry. Uh, you whap him real good, and he goes tumbling ass over tea kettle. So in this one, oh, Lonnie great. is hanging on to the edge of the pit. She sees the boss stand there, and he says, 
what you just said, Michael. She mm-hmm. uses her sweet muscles and dexterity to push herself up, backflip over the top of him, land, and then kick him in the jaw, knocking him right down the hole. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah, you actually would have had uh, advantage on that attack. Oh. It's blind. Well, I rolled a seven, oh, so let's say yeah, I'm just seven. Yeah. the first time when you missed it. Oh, sure, yeah. Well, it's fine. Roll it all back, undo all that. No, I think that what mm-hmm. happens sounds great. I like this story of the theater Oh, it's a great better. story. That's yeah, and any, and any time that, like, it sounded like a rule we got wrong, it was only because of the potion not quite story. working correctly and, and things of that nature. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, um, so the, he's the, falling the, down. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cast Levitate, okay. if that's okay, sure. on um, uh, Nika, excuse me, on Lonnie. You're right. And uh, we're both fully visible now. Talk to me. Mm-hmm. I, I don't half, think... The other half our guilds. Boss, be careful near the pit. Don't fall in. <laughs> Not again. It's full of Jimmy's piss. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think there is this weird thing that I have where, like, I fall 10 feet slower than what it's supposed to be? You can, yeah, I do think you've got, like, some weird slow fall. That's right. You you can just jump down and hero land and be fine. I think I super land, or superhero land. (laughs) I'm still going to cast Levitate on you. No, I appreciate it, yeah. And And this has never happened. Yeah, I'm going to jump on your back. And so it basically says you can... Uh, use your ability to push yourself as if you're climbing. Uh, that being said, if you cast it on yourself, you're able to move up and down um, as part of your move. So, you know, I, I would, you're, it's a willing creature, so it's kind of in between that, I guess I would say. So you, you feel, you feel it's not quite slow fall or whatever it is in this game. Um, feather fall. I don't, mm. I, don't, I don't know which one is in this and which one is in World of Warcraft, but <laughs> feather fall. Yeah. Featherfall is 3.5 Pathfinder. But it's also, I believe, 5th edition. Dungeon. You know that you know that Pathfinder stole everything from... Yeah. Damn. Right? But they, they sold stole. more copies, so... I, that can't be true. You said that before. It's just impossible to be true. I promise. <laughs> I think the math is wrong, though. It's like 3? Or 3.5? She said uh, that Pathfinder has a bigger market share than d d it was before all I whenever I had read that stat, it was before fifth had fifth ed had come out and it was that um Pathfinder had sold more copies of their work than Watsy had. And I think that's just because they I don't know, they have a lot more. Well, it's like I how think. we have a lot of podcast downloads, but not a lot of listeners. Sure. Is my assumption. I mean, it's all perspective, right? Sure. Anyway. <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's neither uh, so, here nor there. Oh, so, sorry. So, you're going down the hole. Is that what I'm getting? Going down the hole. <laughs> hole time. Because Jimmy Skaggs <laughs> told us that they probably were thrown down the hole. Um, okay. So, uh, let's swap over to uh, to Scud and Rowan. Yeah. So the boss did fall down the hole? The boss went down the hole, yeah. Okay. Nice. We're at the bottom of the hole holding the dagger straight up above our heads. You <laughs> <laughs> did the whole time. <laughs> Have you smeared some poop on it so you can do necro or necrotic damage yeah, too? Yeah. Necrotic yeah. necrotic yeah. Double, he's going to be double poisoned cuz this is the second stab. <laughs> poop eye patch. Yeah. Uh, um yeah. so I think I think we see a very uh, a very beat up Scud and Rowan. I think like uh, Scud probably you mean in has terms of their pride, right? Sure, yeah. and um, their bodies. I think Rowan's Scud got a probably... big old shiner. <laughs> Scud has like a big. Uh, he's got a big uh, fibia splinting his own leg. Um, he fell into a big pile of eyeballs, and all those eyeballs um, are embedded in his skin now. Oh my god! No, like you that. fell into you fell into a giant pile of bones. Oh, <gasps> useful. Broken his bones, bones all the way down here. Okay. Um, and uh, you see a. You guys have had a harrowing night. Um, you had to kill some stuff, which you barely recognize. 
Um, luckily, you had uh, a shiv and a bow and arrow. Yes. Uh, Thank God. You you were grinding for some XPs. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. uh, Did we land down here? Yeah. Oh, you're 20. <gasps> nice. Um, and, Shit, uh, wait, they level? Did we level? No, because no, you guys we are used it. our skills and stealthing and yeah. our brains. The last kill. Who knows to, how uh, long we've been down here? I mean, everyone. It's, it's been well like documented. eight hours. <laughs> Who can say how long we've been in this hole? But uh, you you look up in the air because you, you suddenly, like, it's very dark, obviously. Um, and uh, suddenly there's like a blinding light up in the air as the trap door opens. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, you just hear ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Will help scream. David, put Will help scream. Have we ever used Will help scream? We've never done it. Today's um, the day. Today's the day. And uh, you see uh, the boss come plummeting down and smash into this big old pile of bones. I kick him. And, and then, <laughs> good leg. And then what do we see as uh, as 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 uh, Toby and Lonnie descend? I'm riding Lonnie, so... <laughs> what if, Michael, mm -hmm. whenever they fall down, they start to fall a little bit, and then Lonnie gains her bearings, and she realizes that she can go faster than the speed of gravity. So <laughs> she's going to grab Toby and basically run down... Oh, that's good. <laughs> ...the wall to the mm -hmm. bottom thus negating any damage they would take from falling. That also plays into Toby's spell that he cast. Levitate. Um, yeah, and, and I think that that's just a really good plan for them. Yeah, I agree, actually. Okay, what? so <laughs> you know, don't float down with the levitate spell. It seems weirdly more difficult than just floating down, but I love it. I think theater of the mind. You so run true. down the wall; it's way cooler. So true. As long as as long as we aren't granting Lonnie some special powers that she definitely doesn't have. <laughs> Absolutely not. Nothing well, weird here. Special. Uh, Just yeah. run down the wall. Okay, we'll find out. It's more describing something that makes me happy. But doesn't break the rules mechanically. You know, RP you RPM also can't phase through things, but really, really wants to. Just, Damn! What is this? We're kind of like, we're so blocked. We're just edged all the time on what we can phase through, what we can't. <laughs> What's RPM? Just, just let us get through. RPM Michael's just my, constantly uh, cooking you. <laughs> RPM was my wheelchair-bound speedster on Villains <laughs> Underground. Not in like a like in a, in a respectful way. It was handled really. In a respectful. <laughs> I love it. Okay. All right. What happens when we get to the bottom? Uh, you tell me what happens. You see a giant pile of bones and your friends at the bottom. They all look all beat up. Oh my gosh! You guys are alive. Holy shit! Nice job. Way to survive did down you, here. Did you just knock the boss down here? Yeah. Look at him. He's yeah. all hurt. Fuck yeah! Oh, Roy kicked him. Kick the shit out of him. You, he seems to have gone down into the pile of bones, and you don't immediately see him. Rowan is digging. Oh, Rowan, uh, do you have any extra sausage casings? Maybe sausage casings? I'm sorry. <laughs> Tommy gave me some stuff that tastes real good. It's um, a potion. Here, take some. Oh, wait, is it the, the potion? The potion. Fuck yes. Rowan grabs a potion. Glug, 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 glug. And, and then I gave Woo! it to Scud as well. Uh, you said my arms are broken? You uh, your your leg hurts. Oh, it's <laughs> and there's broken. bones everywhere. I didn't break yeah. any bones. How far was this fall? It was like sixty feet. That's I fell sixty hard. feet. I didn't break any bones. I'm not saying I want to break bones. You I just like three d six damage. I think. Wow, I could do that again. Sorry. Right. <laughs> <laughs> this guy who goes up and goes wee. <laughs> I take a swig of the uh. potion. So yeah, you did. Uh, you did have to kill a thing in the night, which was kind of horrific. Um, but you managed to get the jump on it, and you did murder it. Um, it was like a cloaked figure. It kind of looked like Edvard Munch's the scream, but Ooh, like scary. Um, when I but you, when... you were able to kill it. You mean the so... art, not the movie, right? Yes. <laughs> not scream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. No, it's it's the same. Although, maybe a little. 
Maybe There's a little similar. bit. You're right. There's Especially more. depending on how dark vision works. I'm yeah. sorry. I, I knew that was different, but I just wanted to make it for the goof. <laughs> They're actually not wildly different. They're not wildly They're different. Both are like, but I, I knew the difference is what I'm saying. <laughs> I knew you were referring to the painting. <laughs> so wait, so do I, does the potion, the potion lets you cast some spells again? Fourth level spells. I cast nice. summon lesser demons. Ah! No, not here, not here, no. Just <laughs> her to power up and. Uh... Like, no, 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 no. Sorry, it's just been so long. He's a little on edge. It was really weird in here last last We've night. We've been down Sorry. here edging all night. Sorry, I made you wait an extra hour and a half. Oh, it's I mean, you know, it's our fault for not killing the boss, but. In our defense, uh, there were two orcs there, and it was pretty difficult. Oh, hell the yeah. did not work. I did. Hey, the beans did work. Toby, I'm so. sorry. He ate the beans. Uh-huh. The beans are gone, Toby. <laughs> what? You, you have to let go of the beans. What are you, what, what, sh sh what are you saying? <laughs> what are you saying? Fresh out of those beans. Still <laughs> thinking about them, though. I grab Scud by his prison <laughs> jumper and pull him down to my level. <laughs> dig my finger. He jumps up in the air to grab. <laughs> Tell me you have some of those beans, or I'll—I don't know what I'll do. All I have is—is is this, and he pulls out of his uh, pocket a uh, just like a like half a bean, just like crushed up with like a bunch of bone meal in it. And, oh like, no! There's like a cockroach antennae. Okay, uh, uh, Toby snatches it and then falls to his knees and, and, and weeps over it and stares up <laughs> out of the hole with a ray of light casting down on him with a ray of light hitting the bean in his face wow. as tears stream down his face. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Um, <laughs> odds, odds, somebody say odds or evens. Odds. Both! What? Odds. Is it odds? Uh, um, you, I, I take back what I said before. You see the boss, and uh, and he is a large bone sticking through his chest. Um, he fell on something and was impaled horrifically. Oh, this could no. work to our advantage. And he did. Uh, I, pick he did? The, I pick up the boss's face, and I, I, I <laughs> just study his face. It. You what? I study it. He's just staring at the boss's dead face. That's okay. <laughs> He is, appears to have uh, died in terror and anguish. Cool. But it was quick, right? <sighs> it's pretty quick, yeah. As quick as terror and anguish can be, I suppose. Like under two minutes. Oh, yeah. Oh, sure. Okay. Uh, well, I, you know, I wanted, I wanted to look at his face for future illusions. And, and he, you're kind of he, has one last, he has one last cough of blood that spatters <gasps> in your face. Oh, can we loot the body? Does he have any ah, good like, notes on him? Or... Really can loot the body. I feel For bad sure. asking this because I don't think that's something would Lonnie do, but this is something Nico would do. Let's loot the body. <laughs> I think looting in this um, case is uh, alignment uh, agnostic. Per perception it for me. Or actually, I guess that's an investigation, isn't it? Yes. Michael, you know I'm bad at this. I <laughs> know, but that's what it is when you're searching something. Can we okay. all aid by squinting really hard? Mm -hmm. Yeah, squint extra hard and you give, can all him, investigate give him a I'm going to investigate. Level. I rolled a nice. Nice. 21. I rolled a 17. Oh, piss. You guys are like pulling your boots off. Michael, like... before you tell before you tell them, before you tell them what they found, I rolled a natural one, so why don't you tell me what I found? <laughs> Scud is like next to you, like searching a skeleton that like still has like some clothes on. And he's like, "There's nothing here." <laughs> Where did all his meat go? <laughs> Y'all rolled so bad. A twenty-one is not that bad. Oh, I rolled bad. I got a nine. I got a nine. Twenty-one's a, a pretty good roll for solid. a dead. That's a solid. Dead you know what? We actually have like we run the whole game, but we have like completely fail, completely win, and somewhere in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so you find a pack of smokes, oh, you, find, you find a bag of gold, Ooh, cool. um, you find a dagger hidden in his boot, which appears to be magical. 
Ooh. And you find a map. <gasps> a map, Michael to tomorrow. It just says go up. You're at the bottom of a hole, dummy. <laughs> yeah. How to get arrow pointing straight up. I assume yeah. this map leads us to Paylor. Uh, it is a map of the prison complex, and you can <gasps> it uh, it actually shows uh, this the secret entrance, and it shows the boss's lair, Ooh. and uh, you can see how it has a connection to this pit, and uh, in this pit, it shows a secret entrance that leads into level two of the of the of the uh, prison which appears to be uh the guard quarters michael and, yeah and there it marked right on it is uh you see joe cell long shadows office you see um a, michael. A marked impound and then there's michael. like a, there's next to that is another room with a red uh drop of some sort of liquid painted what? onto it <laughs> a blood room probably uh Michael, did you realize that this is where this would lead? Because this is like really convenient for us. This is it great is for us. Nice. This is it's really good for us. Yeah, no, it's great. I'm happy. Uh, did you say that the door was secret in the pit or from mm -hmm. his upstairs? Uh, in the pit. Michael, that's so you're convenient. Down, you're, you've gone down. You do realize. You, you're, oh, you're I, lower. I realized that. I realized that, of course. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously, we're gonna go down. Why is it that like a big character in the future? Huh? Could that be a big character in the future for like, like three minutes at a time? Someone was like, I want to see Brip Rap. Well, oh, I miss Brip Rap. In seven years, Brip Rap talks like this. Wow. Um, yeah, we want to find that fucking door. Maybe, maybe take a bone and put the bone in the, the hole. <laughs> Put the bone in the hole. Uh, well, with with the map, you're able to fairly easily find it. So okay, cool, cool, cool. You uh, you find the door and you open okay. it. Okay, and uh, it leads to um, a sort of a hallway, and then at the end of this hallway, uh, there's like a bunch of like tunnels that are sort of like secret tunnels around the outside of the like thing where normal people walk around and eat their lunch and stuff. Where. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, but ahead of you, you see a number of cloaked figures, <gasps> and they're screaming like the movie. They're uh, sort of like dogpiling on. They're searching the internet. <laughs> <laughs> but it appears to be some sort of person. You see, they're sort of. Um, there's a. I think there's four of these creatures. Okay. And, um, they seem to be almost looks like they're like feeding on and all you can see are these are human legs sort of kicking around as they're uh, they seem to be feeding upon it Ugh. and um and you hear a very a very weak sounding um by Rhaegar's last no! breath and we'll end our episode there. No! 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 Michael! Oh, no! What the fuck? I forgot he was with us. Was he always with us? Well, we he came with him. you, and then you haven't seen him since you got here. He's oh, just weird. No! What's he been up to? Well, getting eaten, apparently. Shit. <laughs> Michael, I'm mad at you. Oh, no. It's bad. Well, you fuck it. I'm so mad. That was fucked up. All right. <laughs> Stop being mad at me. Why'd you have... Was that somebody we met before? <laughs> <laughs> Gav Roof from the United States says, Good am I. If Cletus from The Simpsons, Tina from Bob's Burgers, Elfo from Disenchanted, Speed Racer from The Speed Racer, and Three <laughs> Skeletons with Personalities of the Powerpuff Girls... Decided to go on a quest. This is what you get. It makes you laugh a lot and actually feel for the characters. The chemistry between everyone is amazing. Making the hours of listening feel like minutes. I'd highly recommend it because they're not super intense. I like to take the game with a dash of seriousness that makes it enjoyable. If you want lighthearted D&D &D with the fun people that you have inside jokes with, this is your place. 
I go through the spans of not listening for weeks, and once I decide I want to listen to it, I shoot through a week's worth of podcasts in less than a day. P.S. Every even though I'm from the U.S., Tim say this three times fast. Good, I might. Good, I might. Good, I might. Peppa, bitch. <laughs> Once upon a Tom's Dragon Boner says, Once upon a Tom's Dragon Boner. I started listening because of suggestion from friends since this time I've caught up with the show, started playing D&D, graduated to be the DM in my very own campaign. Yeah. This world and characters that you have created are surely special. I have enjoyed adding your characters into my campaign. Oh, Tony nice. Jiggle Dart has a teleporting potion shop, and Jet Razor has shown up in a tavern or two to put on a show. Thanks for all the work. And just for having fun, a hug for Tug says Aegon regret and this review. I was going to wait to write the review until it was caught up, but due to the situations out of my control, I'm writing one now after listening to episode 257. The situation is as follows. Today I was driving home and listening to the old D&D. When I stopped at a stoplight due to my crippling addiction to my phone, I opened the Instagram while <laughs> I was the light and saw a post by uh, Throfster. Without thinking, I immediately commented Aegon and continued with <laughs> my drive. A few minutes later, I started wondering if Thrifty was ty- tired of people saying that to him. So I deleted it and came here for <laughs> a review. Like a show. Never. Go. Uh, thank you so much. They go on to say many nice things. Uh Aceling's Ghost says, this show managed to revivify me. I've only started listening to podcasts actively again in the last year, and this quickly became one of my absolute favorites. Now that I'm finally caught up uh, and can call myself a slammer, I figured I should review. Uh, Drugs and Dragons helped me help keep me sane while spending countless hours, well, however many hours, or in 200 83 plus episodes in the studio preparing for my undergrad senior art show it has also earned me more than a few looks from strangers when i can't stop myself from bursting out laughing in public i played tabletop games a lot in high school but in the years after moving away for college and adult life i find myself missing the amazing times i had playing DD with my buds thank you Dude, all just from Canada says it's good. Good day, mate. Good day, mate. Nearly a slaver, <laughs> but not quite. I started episode 10 and have yet to rate this podcast before. There is the inevitable rate my podcast rant. You're not my mom. <laughs> anyway, I shall proceed. It's not too shabby and whatnot. A medium to nearly high class venture that keeps you wanting something. Keep up the work, Jason. Uh, um, town, um, town. I'm drunk on D&D, simply the best podcast that I've come across the last year and discovered you about a month and a half ago. I have been your podcast. I'm currently on 263. I grew up with D&D in my late 80s, along with Warhammer 40K, Traveler, Mega Traveler, Cyberpunk, Shadowrun, GURPS, White Wolf, Vampire, and many more. I think everyone talks about White Wolf. Is that the vampire one? Yes, it's fun as hell. It is my favorite game system, and it will get you so horny. <laughs> my lord. <laughs> I have a That's lot of feelings on Vlad. <laughs> uh, you guys work so well together. I'm honestly at a loss for words and trying to describe how awesome I think you all are. From random out of character interactions that will have you rolling on the floor, laughing to characters created over the years. Thanks so much. Uh, South55 says five stars deserves 10. Love the show oh. and the cast can always count on you folks to bring laughs and smiles. Keep it up. Volley 153 from Australia says strangely hilarious. All the way from Australia, you guys are hilarious. I've started listening from the beginning and I'm caught up to about episode 90. I didn't want to leave a review to say I love Tom or anyone in case they get slight <laughs> flourish in an episode. I'm not even up to. Uh, thanks also to Thrifty. You have inspired and given me heaps of ideas for my own campaign. If I've caught up to your most current episode before I read this, I want you you all to skull a rasparita. <laughs> or try to anyways. Matt X Windu. I don't remember if they read review <laughs> <Windu>. titles. <laughs> uh, my favorite D&D podcast. I moved to a new city and was trying to meet new people. And, and this crew showed me how great D&D could be and motivated me to join a group and make new friends. Aww. I'm even DMing my first group this month. Thanks, Little Falcons. We're always thinking. <laughs> Uh, Nyarsko from uh, Canada says best podcast. Good day, mate. Good day, mate. Super funny and lovable characters. Dragon Boner hashtag or hashtag Dragon Boner hashtag My Dark Past hashtag hashtag Rowan Past the Silverweed hashtag Lonnie ah. the equals the Flash. Listening over the past six months, currently to the new storyline and the old, and I love it all. Also, Bear Charger shiny round also caused me to lose myself and everyone on the road. Thought I was insane. Uh, thanks to GeeklyCon North sometime, maybe. Nope. Nope. Uh, sorry, Columbus man. Columbus North? 
depending Columbus on where you are. Columbus north. Is, could be north. Yeah, Columbus is definitely. North. Columbus is north of me. <laughs> I think Columbus uh, is in Canada. Columbus is dead, y'all. Damn, dead as hell. Is that the truth, Damn. though. All right. Well, uh, thank you so much for the reviews. Yes, it means a lot. Thank Thanks, you. everybody. Uh, if you want to get in touch with us, we're on Twitter at Geekly Anchor at DD Podcast. And I personally am at Thrifty Nerd. I'm at Tim Lanning. I'm at Jennifer Cheek. I'm, I'm at Nika at... underscore Howard. Oh, ah! what the fuck was what that? What is that? What? <laughs> what? Oh, man. I just lost it. What? Is this our first time? <laughs> I, I'm fuck? pretty sure it is. I don't know. I am wow. beside myself. <laughs> Should we do this again? Yes, I'll go. It. I'll go after Jennifer, and then you. Hey, go we're gonna, are we gonna change it up after all this time? <laughs> uh, all right. I'm at the Mike Bachman. I'm at Nika underscore Howard. Wait, what? <laughs> no, Jennifer? I don't know. I feel like we needed to do that again. Get to oh, in here. He's all he's right. gone now. He's in the P zone. That's fine. They can cut it to make this perfect. Yes. It'd be so perfect. Please cut okay. it so that we didn't. I didn't fuck up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Did get your fill of action and adventure in this episode of Drunks and Dragons? We'll, we'll make sure to head up. Oh. <laughs> Pop it! Do you want to do this? I'll share the doc with no, you. No, it's fine. You got it. <laughs> make sure to head over to geeklyinc.com where you can find other thrilling podcasts, fan art to make you blush, and care to level up your adventuring quest. Make sure to head over to Apple Podcasts or your other or your other podcast app of choice to leave us a five star rating and review. Also, don't forget to head over to patreon.com slash dandypodcast. Once you become a patron, you have access to exclusive content like ad-free episodes that you won't be able to find anywhere else. Every pledge helps us keep growing and makes this show better with each episode. If you've been wanting to meet your favorite podcasters or other fantastic Geeklies, don't miss out on GeeklyCon 2019 in Columbus, Ohio. Dates are 2000... Sorry. <laughs> Dates are July 18th through the 21st, and tickets are on sale now at geeklycon.com. Get your ticket today and get ready for the geekliest weekend yet. New episodes come out every Monday, so go subscribe, get your quest log filled, and get ready for things to get dicey. Thank you, everybody. We'll see you next week. Until then, keep it dicey. Keep it so dicey. Stop it, export. Oh, oh. Oh, so I guess I'll head to it. Ugh. Tim ran away. I'm doing it. We did it, y'all. We did it, too. Whew. We're done. You never have to record again. <laughs> <laughs> Till next week. Let's oh, do it again. So what did you t title the other... Here, I'll let you type. I, can't I had to piss it. out. I, I noticed that. I had to piss. I, well, I, I started to... Work. Bro. I figured what? you could figure it out. What episode is this? 296. I don't you type. Burr, 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 burr. All right, so I'm titling this 296B for us. Mm -hmm. You know, You guys B. probably shouldn't but. do that because technically, if you think about it, yours is A. You know? I'm just going to do 296 and then my name. Oh, I'm just going to sure. put a 297. Yeah, ah, that's probably really probably the way to go. Wow, awesome. thanks for uh, running at the Dungeons and Dragons, Michael. Yeah, man. That was fun. It was, fun. It was so fun. Time. It, so many people can't us. play D D. And we're so blessed to play D D. Yeah, with a with a star. I'm with so a, yeah, excited. With a star DM. Yeah. yeah. You know, with a DM that gets, you know, half a million downloads a month, you know? <laughs> me, I'm the only one who gets them. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I assume our feed burner or whatever it is now is set up under your name, so probably. It's set up Stop. under a weird old email address, actually. <laughs> remember when I, I used I to... remember that old email address, I bet. <laughs> uh, remember when I used to post everything using the Thrifty Nerd FTP? Man, what a good time. Oh, weird. And then, like, <laughs> literally three months ago, it just stopped working. And Baperson was like, I don't know. I don't know why you use that, but how about, <laughs> how about you use this one? I'm like, no, told me. That's funny. Uh, good time. But remember back in the day, like the idea of anyone but Michael touching the FTP would have been 
Yeah. Insane. Wow. Now he fucking lets me post episodes and I just, you know, sit back and bless you out of the basement sometimes. Jake a Limerita. Mm-hmm. Jack <laughs> off. Not watch the final two episodes of one of the best episodes we've ever made. Even if they don't. I love how mad you are about it, even though you didn't even like them that much. You were like, it's not the me point. It's like about it. And I was like, Tim's a fucking Philistine for not liking you know, the last two episodes of Evangelion. The, the still like the parent uh, website for our website is still thriftynerd.com. Like Geekly yes. technically is under thrifty. Oh, yeah. yeah. There was something we did recently that I was like, wow, oh, yeah. still Thrifty Nerd. We're going to get extremely sued. <laughs> I'm extremely <laughs> excited for the prison. <laughs> well, <laughs> if you love prison so much. I feel like I still need to sign something in order to not go to jail. But for I love prison. Yeah, you just write down a post it. I don't want to go to jail. Sign <laughs> it. <laughs> Realize I yourself. I didn't do anything illegal. It's fine. Damn. And that's all you need to do. Uh, Damn. 57 minutes till Smash Bros. What are you guys going to do for the rest of the 57 minutes? I'm going to play Witcher. Wait, are you sure it's going to are you sure it's going to announce it or it's going to release at uh, midnight Eastern time? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> I'd like that to be the case. I mean, but... I'm sure like the are physical you play version, the physical version will, but Oh, damn big ass titties on my Twitter. Whoa. She had bigger nipples than that. Big old honks. I mean, we can agree. Not necessarily. There are those blessed amongst us. Yeah, that can have can I get a thousand retweets, you thirsty boy? Let me see that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> For just ginormous bazonkers and big old bonkers. Like, I don't think that small nipples or areolas are better. I just think that it's more impressive, you know. Like you if you had small real... titties and huge areolas, that would also be impressive. It's like if the areola is expect. smaller than the nipple, like that's impressive. That's very impressive. That really is yeah. impressive. I, I don't like to think upon that, but <laughs> it's like, how'd you do that? Get any tips? Tell me about you need your a, you body. Need a, you need a microscope works. for link, it. Link, <laughs> link me the toots. Kind of the situation, huh? Would it be like a cone? Is that how that would I work? Like cone. No, I think what happened is you have those big ass nipples, right? Like that, gumdrops, the big ones. And they're so juicy and moist, but they kind of like come out like a mushroom. And then you realize <laughs> okay. that a All little right. bit of right. the area in the, where they're coming out, like a, a delicious mushroom, uh, it's actually uh, the nipple comes out just a, the corona a little bit. I don't like corona. you saying corona. I wish you hadn't said that. Yeah, why? <laughs> what is beer? I don't care for that. This. That's what of the sun, not of the okay, delicious not of the, rice the based dick. beer of the dick. Yeah, that's a thing. Corona. Of the dick? Yeah. I don't read enough fan fiction. My I... <laughs> my favorite fantasy novel is in high school was Corona of the Dick. <laughs> Corona. Oh, it was in the Red Wall series, I think. Ah, no! <laughs> Brian Jocks is crying. <laughs> in hell. <laughs> there he lives. <laughs> Those are some big ass titties. <laughs> is he dead? Yeah. Or does he just live in hell? No, he's dead. He, is he, got, he did not die. He just got... Transported he to hell. just got yeah, and he's hanging out with all the rats and the weasels who are bad in his universe. Man, man, all right, I'm gonna go to bed. Yeah, but have fun, everybody. We love you. Is it time Don't for me to bring the thing? Don't do are we are we shut this straight down? I I haven't yet. No, it's fine. You can. I I completely took out the entire scarf that I was doing because I realized I fucked it up. They, really? The yeah, whole thing? I took the whole thing out. No. Oh. Yeah, I took it, no, no, it was fine because I was learning because I was practicing, so it's not a big deal. Goodbye.